Hello, you all. So first, I want to show you all what my printer is doing. And then I will show you all how to fix it, basically. So I'm just going to print a page. Just going to print a page and I'm going to let y'all see what it prints. So this is the image that I'm trying to print. And the paper comes out blank. Okay. So now I'm going to show you all what I am going to do to fix that problem. Okay, so the first thing we're going to try to do, because my paper is printing blank, we're going to try to just go to settings, maintenance, and nozzle check. And then we're just going to print. It's telling me to load letter slash A4 size plain paper in rear feed and start printing, to start printing. So we're just going to start print. And this is the nozzle check. Okay, so as you all can see, the paper still printed out blank. So it's asking me, are there any missing segments? So I'm just going to say yes. And then it's telling me to clean printer head. So I'm just going to put yet, hit yet, select yes on that. Then it's a clean print head to missing dots. And let's see, we're just going to push start. So it's doing a cleaning head. And it says it's going to take about, it says do not turn power off until complete. This takes about three minutes. So I'm going to skip through it and let you all not wait the three minutes. But Okay, so now it is finished cleaning. It says cleaning complete. Check if nozzle are not clogged. So we're going to do a nozzle check. And so we're just going to print to see if it's clogged still. Okay. Now, as you all see, things have come out. It's printing something. Okay. And it's also telling me the total of blank pages that have printed, which I just printed two. And then it tells me black and white pages. You know, it just tells me everything. Boardless pages, all of that. It gives me a summary of what I've printed. So, now it's saying, are there any missing segments? So, if you look at this top piece here, where it's a BK and YMC, you could see that segments are missing so it is a gap there and it is a gap there if you could see that Let me make sure y'all can see so i really can't see it that well on the yellow but i know for sure on the black that is some segments missing so i'm just going to select yes and then it's telling me to clean print head and i'm going to go ahead and do that start cleaning and it's going to take about three minutes again i just i did want to get on here and say um you may face more issues with converting your um printer to sublimation printer than using the regular ink that is made for this printer and that's because if you noticed or sublimation ink is a little bit thinner it's wetter it's uh, it's a little different than regular ink so if you using your printer as a sublimation printer you may have to do more cleanings and things like that more often than you would if you just had a regular printer and you was just using the regular ink that goes with the printer so just a tip 
Okay, so I'm gonna do a nozzle check again. So instead of hitting finish, I'm just going down here nozzle check and I'm gonna push okay to proceed. And then I'm gonna print it. Okay, and I'm gonna show you all the difference. As you can see, it's some segments missing, like at the bottom, I see that one. I see this little bottom piece segment missing. I really can't tell in the color, but that's just one. So if you want to, you can keep doing that because you see it wasn't there at first at the bottom. You can keep doing it until it's good enough for you. But I'm just going to go ahead and print what I need because I'm ready to print it. And then I'm just going to say... So now I'm just going ahead and printing what I actually need. Okay. And then later on, if I want to go back in and, and fix what, um, clean the head in again, then I'll do that. But thank you all for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Comment down below and thank you. Bye. Until next time.